Welcome back. That wasn't too long to wait. Uh, so let me introduce you to Joe Houghton, November Club's new artistic director. Hello. <laughs> Thank you, Ginzia. It's, uh, it's lovely to be here at this great event in this wonderful space um, that I've admired so much for so long. Um, thank you to the Lit and Phil for having us. Uh, this is, it, it, it's really fantastic. And, and what a wonderful conversation that was. It's uh, it, over the last couple of months hearing more and more about, about Lost, Found and Told, and of course hearing them, he, hearing the tales as well. Uh, they're, they're remarkable. And actually learning a little bit more about the creative process has been great. Um, and also, I just want to say, kind of to celebrate you, actually, in the way that, that, that as a company, you managed to change a piece of work that was supposed to be, to be a live piece of work into something really quite different and uh, quite unique. And, and, and with that in mind, actually, I need to say, uh, and this is my job now, please buy them. <laughs> um, they, uh, they're available on our website and they're uh, available... Uh, th through Bandcamp, and uh, they're a really great uh, Christmas present, as you said, but also kind of more importantly, they are a really easy and uh, interesting way to support us as a company um, at a time when we can't make any live work. So uh, I promise I won't say it again, but, but please buy them. <laughs> um, Chinzia, there's, uh, there's quite a lot to do now. Um, there is... Uh, there's some, some things to give you, and there's something that's been made for you. And uh, I know you've got some things to give me. Um, but before we do that, I just wondered if we could take a moment to, to think about this place and to talk about why we're here. Um, because it's not accidental. There is a reason that we, we came all the way down from Morpeth this evening. Um, why are we in this special place? Why are we in the Lytton Phil tonight? Yeah, I mean, the Lytton Phil is a very, very special place, I think, in a lot of people's hearts um, in the Northeast. Uh, it's special to me because it feels fitting to, I suppose, to mark the end of my time with, with November Club because my time with November Club really started here. Uh, 15 years ago, before really November Club had found that name, um, I produced my first piece of war work up here in the Northeast uh, and worked with the, the library staff and with the wonderful Kay Eason and the trustees at the time here at the Lyttonville to, to make a piece called the Novocastrian Philosophers Club. And, uh, and so it feels fitting to have good ends and good beginnings in the right place. And this is definitely the right place. Can you tell us a little bit more about Nova Castrian Philosophers Club? Because, I mean, I wasn't around then. No. And, um, you were probably still at school, Joe. <laughs> Not quite. But, um, uh, uh, yeah, it, 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 it's, it, it sounded like a really remarkable thing, a really exciting thing. And I just wonder if you yeah. could, just for a moment, cast your mind back 15 years to, uh, to, to, to that, that production. Time. I mean, I think what was remarkable about it is that we had the luxury of n nearly must have been 14 months to make it. Uh, and I think, uh, you know, nowadays that feels like a phenomenally long amount, uh, amount of time to make a piece of work. But it was more than a show. I mean, it took the format of a promenade performance through this building and the building next door, which uh, is the Mining Institute. And, uh, and it was also about trying to find a way in which to get people thinking about culture differently. Now the Lytton Phil, is a, it was always a vibrant place. I mean, obviously it's a vibrant place, but it didn't have the range of cultural events that it had back in 2007. And I remember when I was you know, talking to Kay and, and, the, and the marketing director at the time about wanting to make a show here, I remember they took me aside and they said, are you sure? You know, because it's, it's not a theatre, you know. <laughs> and I said, I know, that's what's so wonderful. It's a real place with real people, with real stories, an amazing archive. And I think one of my you know, long-lasting memories of all the shows I've been involved in over the years was that there was a moment in the Novocastrian Philosophers Club when the audience, in small groups of about, I think there were about six or seven, had to go through a little kind of passageway, which is a secret passageway that takes you into the Mining Institute from, from this building. And we'd created a waterfall in there, and there was real water. <laughs> and the audience had to, one by one, don a waterproof um, uh, uh, 
thing, Macintosh, and in they went and they got wet with real water in a library. I mean, that just tells you the kind of amazing people who, who work here. And then you open the doors into the Mining Institute and it was all misty and an owl just flew towards you. And it really was one of those, you know, breathtaking moments. And that owl went up and down, up and down. <laughs> you know, I tell you, it de definitely deserved an equity card. Um, <laughs> and it was called Whisper. I'm sure uh, Fiona Stanfield, who's here somewhere tonight, will remember Whisper. Um, so that is a, a memory I have of that show that I'll never forget. Yeah. Great, great. But I am inheriting more than just a show. Like, it, it, this is about... Um, uh, not just about you know what hasn't changed, but also what has changed. Like this is a very different company from from the company that it was 15 years ago. Um, so, so tell me how it has changed, Chinzia. Well, it's definitely changed. I mean, those Novocastrian philosopher de philosophers club days was me sitting up in the spare bedroom in our house, um, sort of doing everything. Now we have, you know, as an organisation, we're, we're really professionalised. There's an amazing staff team who works so hard with me and will work with you, Joe. Uh, an amazing set of trustees, and they really are amazing. I don't use that word uh, lightly. In a company the size of ours, which is a small company, you know, the trustees play a vital role because they're supporting us as individuals as well as uh, you know in terms of their duties their company duties um, you know we receive revenue funding now goodness me you know we're, not, we're able to think long term everything has changed and everything has changed you know for the positive in order to stay the same in terms of its artistic vision and principles yeah it, that, that's interesting that you say that because I think I think one of the things that has been really clear to me in the, in the last couple of months is that, that for you, ne November Club is, is a family, actually. And it's a family not just to the people inside the building and not just a family uh, of, the, of the people outside the building, like the trustees and the associate artists, but actually it's a family that's about everybody out there and everybody that's watching us tonight and everybody that would be with us if you could be with us in person. And that's that's a wonderful thing to come into. And that's, Slightly daunting. But and that's <laughs> where the word club came from. That's why I settled on club. I mean, November was because I just quite liked the sound of it. <laughs> but the, it, it, the Nova, Nova Castrian Philosophers Club invited a group of people who self-selected to come. And it wasn't an expensive show. And then you became a member of this club. So the club continues through anyone and everyone is invited into the club. Wonderful. Well, as a new member of that club, <laughs> and 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 on behalf of that club, there's um, there's some things, there's some parts to this evening that you don't know about that that, that we're going to do now. Um, now, when we planned this evening, I know that you want you, it was very important to you that we marked it with some kind of artistic moment. Uh, it turns out you were not the only person that had that idea. Um, <laughs> so the first thing, the first thing that that we have for you um, is is something that's been made for you, and this is uh, this is a song um, and you're going to hear it and uh, uh, the family are going to hear it at the same time um, and this song has been made for you by Katie who we've met and uh, by Zoe Lambert and by Phil Corbett and by Jane Holman oh so God. let's take a look I know Teacups and zebras and audiences dancing Evacuee children, Patricia romancing Elephants, judges, a dentist that sings These are examples of chintzier things Down in the trenches the soldiers are dying Explorers suspended, a white owl is flying Two cooks in the kitchen, a ghost figure springs These are all part of the chintzier things She takes actors to strange places At a special night and caution flies out as the magic comes in And everyone loves the crack God 
gardens and houses, a library, a station, backstage kerfuffles, a gift to the nation, eccentric collectors and DNA strings. These are examples of chintzier things. Images, visuals, costumes and details, plot lines meandering, ending in dovetails, accompanied by Katie on keyboard and strings. These are the pieces of chintzier things. Though she's leaving, and we're grieving, mustn't Simply remember she gave us these things And then we would feel so bad So bad <laughs> Oh my god, that is just so brilliant Brilliant. Thank you so much, all of you. <laughs> there is also something I forgot speechless. to add, Sorry? which is that that was written by Fiona. So it was, it was, a, it was a team effort all around. <laughs> that was just absolutely brilliant. We're not done yet. We're not oh done yet. Oh, my God. Don't, Thank don't, you don't, so don't, much, yeah. Katie, Imogen, <laughs> Fiona, all of you. Uh, yeah, all of you. Thank you. Brilliant. So I told you there was something that was made for you. Okay. And there's also some things to give you. Um, so, and actually these have been made for you as well, um, in, in true November Club fashion, I think. Um, so we have, uh, the first thing we have is a memory box that has made, been made by Imogen. And this is a memory box of all sorts of things, as I understand it, of your time at uh, November Club. Um, some things are things that were in shows, I think, and some things... Uh, are pictures of shows and some things are, are posters and there's 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 lots to look at. So um, I think Image is going to come uh, going to come and give it to you now. Oh, I just sanitised my hands. Is that okay? Right. That's the top, is it? Okay. Oh, look at this beautiful bow. The way it just comes away. <laughs> Doing no nothing very good for the microphone, I would imagine. Oh my goodness, this is absolutely fantastic. If you can see that um, there, <laughs> there we are. And the back of it is just beautiful as well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Brilliant. I have a thing about cabinets of curiosities, so this will be my own personal cabinet of curiosities. Thank you. Thank you, Imogen. <laughs> Great. And we're still not done yet. So there are two other things to give you that um, uh, will be given to you together, and Katie's going to give you these things, Chinzia. And uh, this is a, a, a photo album of, I believe... Every single November Club show is in this photograph album, oh my. in some capacity. Fantastic. Am I right, Imogen? Yes, every single November Club show. Well, um, you have saved me going through the photo archive because I wanted to get, <laughs> take memories myself. And oh, wonderful. There is also in there, some lurking around, um, a memory stick. Um, uh, yes, I found Which have it. been a big feat. Memory sticks have been a big feature of my last two months at November Club. Um, uh, but this is a slightly different uh, uh, memory stick. This is uh, messages that have been put together for you um, that uh, you can take some time to look at uh, this evening. Um, and uh, I believe there's some, some really quite special stuff on there. Oh, my um, God, look at this. This is just beautiful. <laughs> this is just beautiful. Oh, now you know I'm off now. Here we go. <laughs> look at that. That's beautiful. And... Uh, Oh, beautifully made, and oh, brilliant photographs. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. And thank you to everybody who's still watching, if you're not bored by now. Thank you for, for because you all made, you know, made these memories with, with all of us, because there, there is no theatre without its audience. We don't do it just for ourselves. 
So thank you. Thank you. Um, so I'm, I, I am going to let you speak in a minute. I know, oh, no, I, I don't want to. I, I just want to go this. and have a look at all my things, <laughs> all my beautiful things. Uh, I know there's a bit of this that, 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 that I don't know about. Um, and and I'm, I'm really looking forward to that. <laughs> but uh, in the absence of, of, I guess, being able to, to talk to all of the wonderful November Club family this evening, um, I, think, I think I want to say three things, OK? The first is, and they're all thank yous, really. I think the first is, is thank you for your ambition, Jinzia, because without your ambition, the, this organisation wouldn't exist. And... Um, I want to say thank you for your leadership, <laughs> because without that, this would be a very difficult company to take over. And without your leadership, the family wouldn't be together. And I think the last thing that I want to say on behalf of everybody is thank you for your love. Thank you for your love for the work and for the company and for the county. And I think if we can say one thing to you tonight, it would be that. So. I'll leave that with you, take a moment, and then it's in your hands. Thank you. Oh, I, I mean, I am completely speechless, and those of you that know me well know that I'm not often, you know, speechless, but I am speechless. I don't know what to say. Um, but what I do know to say is that November Club is going to be in very, very safe hands. I have every, every confidence that Joe is going to do wonderful things. Uh, he's going to bring the company to new, new, um, new places, new artistic places. Um, and I'm going to enjoy being a member of the club just outside of it <laughs> and, and just observe it grow and just observe it go in lots of different directions. And it's going to be tremendous fun because I'm going to be an audience member and I'm going to be surprised. I might even sign up to be a participant. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. Um, I do want to um, say a few words and, and I have a couple of things I would like to give Joe um, to help him on his way with the team as he um, takes on the company. So... Uh, Obviously, we're in Northumberland, and there's a lot of walking to do around the county, and you, there's a l lot of distances. I mean, it's the biggest county in England. And I know jo Joe's a bit of a walker, so um, you need a receptacle in which to put some items that I think are absolutely vital for you going, going into next year as, um, as, as artistic director. All right. Uh, so here is a little backpack. Thank you. A little kind of day you. pack backpack. Now, a bit like Mary Poppins, I've got my items here that I'd like to give you. So, um, first of all, um, I know you think you're starting in January. Well, I'm afraid, did you know that we're a constituted organisation? <laughs> and we have got articles of association and charitable objectives, and there's a lot of reading getting your head round um, the company in terms of legalese. So you, you've, got, you've got your Christmas reading there. Thank you, yep. Um, well, well, November Club is a very big county as I said so you're going to need some maps <laughs> so you've got a lovely collection of maps of Northumberland in here so you've got plenty of time to study those thank you you're going to need them um, but of course because the county is so big you can sometimes get lost so you will need a compass to help oh. you find your way if you get lost and we all get lost and it doesn't matter because we've got <laughs> great people around us and our family to help us find the way and find our way out of the woods. So a compass is always useful. Thank you. There you go. Uh, now, at November Club, you know, we're very democratic. But ultimately, at the end of the day, there is a boss. So I eventually <laughs> had, got, had got this mug made that says, I'm not bossy, I am the boss. So in any moment where you feel that you need to make a difficult decision and overrule people, just remind them, you are the boss. <laughs> this, this mug has been the feature of many Zooms. I've admired your mug that says, I'm not bossy, I am the boss. So, so <laughs> yes, this is, there you go. I've seen this before, or maybe not this one, but I've seen, I've seen, I've seen your version, yeah. Now, sometimes uh, 
things can get you down. I mean, that's that's life, ups and downs. And um, that's again, it's okay. It's okay. You know, you've got to ride the bad times with the good times. But my little secret for getting through these times, and Mrs. T in Amble will know what I mean here. Little wee dram now doesn't do anyone <laughs> a bit of harm at all, does it, Mrs. T? Um, so we couldn't quite stretch to a big bottle on the November Club That's budgets. okay. It, it fits very well in the mug. But it fits very well <laughs> in the mug. So, you know, it's okay to go into your, into your office and take a wee, wee, wee shot of, of whiskey. And finally, of course, what you're going to need, not just on a practical level, but also on, a, on the level of making work in unusual places and found spaces across, across the country, really, are keys, because... After all, our um, you know people who hold the keys to the various buildings and hidden spaces, and also the office key, <laughs> um, are very important. So your keys are going to help you make that start as well in the new year. So there you go. So those are all the things um, that I think that you need to put in your knapsack for your little November Club toolkit. And... Um, and I say this, you know, I get stuck into those memonards quickly because there's a lot to get your head around. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. You're on your way. Welcome. Chinzia, thank you. <laughs> thank you. It's uh, what wonderful things. Like, and it's lovely that you ended on the keys because it's not just about the keys to the building. It's about the keys to, to the county in some ways and it's about the keys to the club and to, to the family and, you know, if there's, if there's one thing I could say to... I've, I've said my things to you. If there's one thing I could say to, to the family, it's, it's come with me <laughs> on this next bit of the journey. Um, and there will be, as you know, there, there'll be lots in the new year to talk about and there'll be lots in the new year to do, hopefully. And, um, Chinzia, I hope that you will come on, on part of that journey with us as well. Um, and I hope that the whole family will. And on that note, all I have to say is thank you for coming, for joining us. Have a really great Christmas. And November Club will see you in the new year. <laughs>